we're trying things. There is options. Um, I found, apart from Westy, which is a long-term injury, and, and Liam Brickard, which is a cup tie, everybody fit. It's a nice coincidence, I to say, because uh, before the final, which gave me plenty of options, which it, made, uh, it makes the situation very difficult for the players. First, because of the quantity of options. Secondly, because they're going to have to fight as well for a place in the squad. So there are going to be a few sad people, which they, they are not even going to be on the bench. It's going to be it's going to be new because we didn't have that before. We had a few out of the squad, but they were not playing. Now it's going to be one of the the players that they've been playing. If nothing happened, no, from now to the to the game. That's why sometimes when you get to these opportunities, you need to try to take it because you don't know when it's coming next. And if you ask the Sunderland fans, they will tell you, well, maybe we need to wait another 15 years. Um, so that, that, that's the biggest challenge for us, to make sure that we do everything possible. There is no regrets because we don't know when we're going to be there again. So we need to try our best to take this opportunity. I have to be honest, normally the day before I, I, I do sleep very well as a player and as a manager. The day after is a nightmare. I keep playing the game, I keep kicking people and shouting and moving. But before the game, I normally I'm, I'm okay. The, the thing I would like to have is the feeling, personally, that I've done everything possible. And if I got that feeling, I, I normally do sleep well. So uh, the hope is no different. You will see my eyes on. On Sunday, and you can, you can say if uh, if I had a good night. I, um, then, of course, walking into the stadium is going to be special. It's always nice to go to places where it's full and you got so many people behind you. It's a great feeling. We are uh, very fortunate to be in this position.